Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. We will begin this haul with a few Dollar Tree Easter items. But first, if you haven't already, please like and subscribe and click the notification bell. Now, I picked up these carrots, these Easter carrots from Dollar Tree that are wrapped in twine. I picked these up because I was inspired by a YouTuber by the name Jay Monet DIY. I hope I'm saying her name correctly. She created a beautiful galvanized potted greenery with the carrots surrounding the pot. I thought that was so creative. I'll leave the link to her video in the description below. I'm not certain what I'm going to do with them, but I thought, I thought these were a must have for Easter. I also picked up the carton of eggs. I've been seeing these for a couple of years, never purchased them. I think it's so cute and I finally picked them up. And Dollar Tree has the salt and pepper shaker bunnies. They also have it in the yellow chick. This will be really cute on my Easter decorated table. These beautiful angels are also new at Dollar Tree. They each have gemstones within their wings. Faith has the praying hands, Peace has the dove, and Dream has the heart. And each of them do not have any facial features. And they have some weight to them as though they are stone. I'm so glad I picked them up. I already have a nice place for them in my home. I also picked up these ceramic pineapples. I may do a DIY with them or I will leave them as is and add them to my home decor. I also purchased what looks like a honey pot to me. It says, count your blessings. And on the label it says blessing jar. And it has a little embellishment at the top. Of course, I love embellishments, but I thought it was really cute. And I will probably put this in my kitchen. I have quite a few of these candle holders and I haven't done a DIY with them yet. So look forward to sometime in the future, my doing a DIY with this. It seems like I have more ideas in time, but I'm working on that. I picked up one of these mercury cracked glass candle holders. I may get a couple more because I do have some ideas for this as well. And I've gone ahead and purchased a couple more of the clear cracked glass candle holders. I really like these candle holders. I always have, and they've been around for years at Dollar Tree. And I picked up two more of the silver candles. I suppose you may have guessed, I do like silver. I also like gold as well, but silver is usually my go-to and it goes well with my decor. I picked up some more glass beads. I like the color on these. And there was this one as well. I think they are very pretty. I like these a lot. I was finally able to find Love in this formation, which this one also came in gold. Exo, Exo, Live, Laugh, Love, Family, and Memories. So I believe this is all of them. I wanted to have all of them, and I finally. Do. Now I have to determine how I'm going to display them all. For a long time, I've been trying to find these mirrored peel and stick wall creations. I only found one dream, two loves, two feathers, and four packs of the butterflies. I will more than likely use these in future DIYs. I don't know how new these are, but these are mirrored plaques that can stand. This one says, bless our home with love and laughter. And you can see the frame is mirrored. I bought two like this one. 
This one says, friends and family make a house a home. As you can see, there are gemstones centered in some of the flowers in the plaque. I think they're very pretty and will go very nice in my home. Picked up some very nice labels from Dollar Tree. And they had these mirrors. I think I'm going to put these to good use. I thought these were very classy and pretty. There isn't very much you have to do to them, but more than likely I will change the color of the frames and see if there's anything else I can come up with. Have any of you seen these glitter string lights? It's only a six count. They have them in different colors, purple, gold, bronze. I may have an idea for these, but I may have to use Mod Podge on them because that glitter is just falling off of those balls. I haven't lit them up yet to see what they look like. I love the size of the bulbs. I bought a few of these. Dollar Tree finally has the lead tea light candles with the crystals. I know that you can get these crystals in a bulk amount that's more economical, but while I was at the Dollar Tree, I went ahead and grabbed a few of these. I also purchased more of the copper and silver wire lead lights. I like using these in DIYs and each of them have 12 lights and it's 4.3 feet long and I have found that the length works perfectly for me. I purchased a couple of push lights. I have something in mind for those also. And now we can move on to some ribbon that I purchased from Dollar Tree. To me, this is more of a refined burlap and you get nine feet of it. This is more of a raw natural burlap and you get three yards of this. And it also comes in this dark brown, which is also raw and natural, and you do get nine feet of it as well. I decided to get this glitter mesh, which looks like brown or bronze, and it's see-through. It's like a webbing, some type of webbing, and you get nine feet of it, and I think I'll be able to put this to good use. I really like it. I just haven't come up with anything as of yet that I would use it for, and I purchased two. And I like the color. I purchased three of the lace ribbon. I do have a DIY coming up where I'll be using these. And I found satin ribbon in silver. I purchased quite a few books from Dollar Tree for my daughter. She likes books that are over a thousand pages long, which most of these are not. I will not bore you with titles. I wanted to show you how many hardcover books I was able to get from Dollar Tree for a dollar. And hopefully they are very good books and she will read them. I bought this one for myself, The Drop 10 Diet. Never heard of it, but for a dollar, I thought it was worth a read. And I have some cookbooks. Now this one is for baking whoopie pies. And it's hardcover. And it gives you step-by-step -step instructions and recipes for whoopie pies. That looks good. This one's a nice paper bag, Fresh Food Nation. And it has pictures and recipes for healthy eating. Okay, and my final book is a hardcover, movable feast with fine cooking. Very pretty pictures and recipes. So I've decided every time I go to Dollar Tree, I will look for cookbooks because I'm always looking for new healthy cooking ideas. I picked up some galvanized pots in each size. I picked up some of the flowers that have been difficult to find in a lot of Dollar Trees. I did pick up some lavender. I bought four of them and some of the greenery bouquet. I picked up these beautiful brown 
sunflowers, the inner petals are made of burlap, if you can see that. And this definitely goes with my home decor in my family room. I hope I can find maybe four more of them because I have some great ideas for this. They actually look like I paid more than a dollar for them because of the pretty burlap petals. I picked these up a couple of weeks ago, the onion grass. I do look forward to using these in an upcoming DIY. I purchased a few succulent picks. Of course, not all at the same Dollar Tree, but aren't these nice? I like that they are big and very pretty, very realistic as well. get some pots. These are in silver and black. The other colors I know they come in are in bronze and black and gold and black. I picked up these two planters. I thought for one dollar they are a nice size. I purchased some raffia, some acorns. This is definitely for a DIY. Potted lavender. This will go in my daughter's room. Brown that tubing that I'm using in a DIY. This is a good buy. This is a lot of floral moss for one dollar. And I did get two of them. This concludes this Dollar Tree haul. I hope you made it to the end. I actually have two more segments which are skincare and groceries but that would have made this already long haul even longer. My next haul will feature the products you see here, skincare and groceries, therefore stay tuned. My next DIY will be uploaded soon as well. Thank you so much for watching. Please like and share this video. Subscribe and click the notification bell for so much more to come. God bless and bye for now.